So fresh bale of hay placed out for the girls. And here they come. Hey girls. You beautiful girls, you've got fresh hay. Fresh hay. You coming girls? Not hugely interested in the fresh bale of hay. I've been feeding them too well, obviously. Loads of hay in the shed. <laughs> Good boy, Java. Good boy. Okay, so if I walk away from the hay, Hopefully, you guys will go and eat the hay. How are you, Kestrel? It's a beautiful sunny day again. And the clouds and the warmth are coming with rain and wind over the weekend by the looks of it. No interest in the bale of hay. Probably because there's still hay in the shed. Having an itchy back. Ear feather. Yeah, all warm in their wooliness and no interest in food, extra food. Well, there's this morning's first leak. That pipe is split. So that's the mains pipe underneath going up to this tap. That tap feeds loads of water tanks. This one's just the yard tap. So that means switching off the mains and then every once in a while switching it back on again to fill the water tanks. Royal pain. But the plumber said he'll come Monday uh, and fix all my leaks that I find. So that's one. And there's the second one, right in the join split. 
can see that join has split. Very annoying one. Leak two. Here they come. Look at the difference. No frost. Hey girls, come on. Woo! Little bit waiting in queue. Kestrel, right there at the front. Come on, girls! Storm's coming. And in they all go. I've got to go and check that the water didn't burst its pipe coming into the orchard. There's several burst pipes we have already. Hey dogs. Yeah, and I've got to lock the girls in the laneway because uh, the chute is going to be going through. They go along that laneway with loads of dogs and guns, etc. today. So I'm just making the sheep more safer. Because dogs will come in here as well. Strange dogs. Now, when the mains froze and the sheep were running out of water, we went down to our aquifer in the field, in the great oak field, and we filled up these buckets, which are now probably empty. These two are, and this one is. Yep, they're all empty, but they were full yesterday, and then the thaw came, so they got water via the water tank. So I can take these back down to the sheds for the next time I need to bring them water. Because see, when the water containers were in the shed, they didn't freeze because the sheep were in there keeping them warm, believe it or not. Now, hopefully, last night this thawed out and hopefully there's no burst pipes up here. I've already got two burst pipes. Nope. And the water is coming back in. You can see the ice is underneath. There's the ice right there. There's the ice. So, but the water is mains is thawed, so they've got water. Anyway, it's beautiful and uh, not frosted. Isn't that right, kitty? You beautiful kitty. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh, don't. I'll step on you by mistake. Okay. Hello, you beautiful kitty. You beautiful. Yes. Yes. My hands wet. You're such a beautiful kitty. Yes, you're gonna go topsy turvy on that tree, aren't you? You beautiful kitty. Yeah. Off to look for more burst pipes. So two so far, and hopefully those are the only two. Sorry, ladies. Yeah, you're gonna have to stay there for the next hour and a half maybe two hours, just because I don't want you spooked by dogs. So come on dogs, my dogs, come on. Come on, come on. Good dogs. So you, uh, no, we're leaving them alone. We're going down the edge of them because I don't want them to be spooked. They'll lie down and relax. They'll climb the wall and nibble that ivy 
and uh, nibble the bits of grass further down here. So, also they've got this lovely wall against the weather that's coming in. So they should be fine. Where's Kitty? Oh, there you are. Your brother was in the orchard with us. Yeah, I was wondering where you were. Hey, Kitty. Hey, Mustard Kitty. He's all the way up the top end of the, or of the wall. Here he comes. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> hey, Kitty. Come on. I'm being purred on by time, which makes, ah, 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 Inca, leave it. Which makes the uh, camera move. And your brothers, you good brothers. Inca, no. Java, no. Enough. Leave them be. Inca, leave them be. Java. Sorry, ladies. I know there's lovely grass out here, but you're not getting them. Wow, she's getting really big. Ear feather. How many babies are you carrying? Come on. You all there? Come on. Inca, out. Rindle, come on. Whoops. Got to do that quick or they'll get out. Okay, you guys get to sit here for a little while. Just till the people with guns and dogs pass. Okay, so take it easy. Hang out, lie down, chew your cuds. They've had their breakfast. Horses have had their breakfast and I'm gonna let them out because I want ear feather, not ear feather, what are you called? Grasshopper to move after her crash yesterday. She's still sound. They're excited about getting out. Easy, 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 easy. Okay. Well, she's absolutely sound. That's great. Jeez. Uh-oh, cat fight between the brothers up the tree. <laughs> all the sheep, like the sheep are all watching the fight. <laughs> oh my goodness, cat fight. Time, leave your brother alone. Oop. The sheep are all saying, we're out of here. We don't want anything to do with the cat fight. It sounds nasty. Time! Kitty, kitty! Come here! There's Maya. Kitty, kitty! Shh, shh, shh. Leave time alone! Flicking tails. Angry cats. Time! Leave your brother alone! Come on! Look at him siblings. Get down. Come here. Good kitty. Good kitty. Come on. Kitty, kitty. Come on, kitty. Come on. Good boy. Come on, kitty, kitty. He's bossing it, scratching his mark, saying, this is my tree. I'm the boss of the brothers, ignoring me. The sheep all retreated up the laneway. Cats might be small, but they're still a predator animal. Now, having a bath, saying, yeah, I'm totally relaxed. I'm cool with this. Or mustard. You all right, kitty? Yeah, kitty. It's gonna stay up there. And there's a load of, this is a tree that a lot of house sparrows are in. 
there's one right there flitting about the branches. Usually it's full of a flock of them, but for obvious reasons, they are somewhere else. They've flown to another location. There we go. Good boy. Come on, kitty. Says, nope, I'm going to sit up here for a while because the brother Grimm is here chewing sticks, doing all the demonstrations that I'm a boss cat. Is that right, Mustard Kitty? Aren't you bold? You're so mean to your brother. You're very mean to your brother. Yeah, you're the boss cat. We all know that now. And we're aware of it for quite some time. Yes, you're bold. Up oh, there we go. That's uh, <laughs> what usually occurs. Isn't that right? He lands on my shoulder. You're so mean to your brother. You are so mean to your brother. Cats. <laughs> Look, if you lean, he's going to lean onto my hand, which means he's going to fall down. Come on. Don't do that too much. You big, bold boy. He's such a bold boy. He is such a bold boy. So time was beating up his brother. Java, it's not advisable to get in the middle of when cats are playing or fighting. Java says, can I play with you guys? Not advisable, Java. Seriously, not advisable. Anyway, snowdrops are coming up. Look at that. That's a big enough clump that I'll probably have to divide it. But they're all coming up everywhere. I guess this cat fights over. Those are woodland irises. They're small little browny yellow irises when they bloom those stalky things that look like grasses. Not a bother on them. Beastly cat. Oven mitts the top one. Time is number two. Flock was relaxed. I'm going to turn it back up in the orchard. Leave them be, Inca. Inca? No. Maya, no. Leave be. Okay, girls, you can go back in the orchard. Go, whoops, go get water and hay. There you go, girls.
Atta girls. Come on. Hey, hey, Brindle, leave it. There they go. Brindle, come back. So, a big wind is coming tomorrow. Very high winds. So this is the precursor to it, is this wind here. So it's gonna be wind, loads of wind and rain tomorrow. Hey, Ishka. Where'd your daughter go? There's Miss Daisy Rose. Your daughter has run away from me. Up oh, here she comes. And walking. Lessons have been learned. She won't go lead the way, but she'll follow her mother. Yep, she's not following her mother. She's still worried. Go on, walk on. Good girl. Walk on. There we go. Her mother came back to lead her, to lead her in. And they're safe out of the rain. And they're gonna be out of the storm that's approaching. Huge windstorm we're having. Come on, oh, you found my carrot stash, you wicked pony. Here. There's one apple for you, and one apple for you. You stay there, Penny. No, 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 no. She doesn't like the alpaca keeps spitting at her. This is not for you. This is grasshoppers. No, no. If you want these, you gotta come over here. Come on, come on. The alpaca keeps spitting at her. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. No, leave grasshoppers alone. Come here. Look, you want an apple? You guys have gotten so neurotic all of a sudden. Look, a carrot and an apple. There we go. And you had yours. Oh. Ugh. And yours, Miss Daisy Rose. There you go. It's on the floor. There's one more. This one's for you, to get you used to me again. You're still scared of me. Good girl. Miss Daisy Rose is eating hers, but Grasshopper's still nervous of me. Anyway, they have loads of water, hay, and they're in shelter. So are you guys, I've had to put this here to prevent her from bullying the horse away from the food.
Look at her trying to get at the horse. Can't get it. Ha 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 ha. No, you can't get in there. I better tie this on so it doesn't fall down. I better go do that now.